On the Health Watch, growing demand for CBD products. They're made from the part of the marijuana plant and used to treat certain medical conditions. Health reporter Stephanie Stahl is here with the details. Hi, Steph. This stuff is all the rage, you guys. You know, there have been mixed reviews about CBD products and how well they work. It is only FDA approved for children with seizure, seizures, but people are using this for all kinds of ailments. Vicki Ray Thorne has fibromyalgia, PTSD, and severe depression. After making diet and exercise changes, she started using CBD oil 10 months ago. I find my anxiety is highly reduced and my pain levels as well. CBD comes from hemp or marijuana plants, but contains little or no THC, so products won't get you high. It's amazing and it changes lives. This 14-year-old girl has been using CBD capsules and gummies for a year. She and her mother agreed to speak if their identities were concealed. The teen suffers from an autoimmune disease causing obsessive compulsive disorder and separation anxiety. She missed 264 classes in one school year. We'd pull up to the school building and like I wouldn't get out of the car. I just couldn't. And after CBD? I can go hang out with my friends. I joined the debate team. And I really credit it with giving her her life back. A couple of small studies have shown CBD reduces seizures in children, and the FDA just approved the first prescription drug for that purpose. CBD oil is not snake oil, nor is it a miracle drug. Dr. Ring says CBD can help with chronic pain issues like? Arthritis, rheumatoid arthritis, and also in inflammatory or autoimmune issues like Crohn's disease and multiple sclerosis. Now, some doctors feel there aren't enough long-term studies on CBD and laws about it can be conflicting and confusing, even in states where medical marijuana is legal. In spite of all of that, sales have been skyrocketing. Yeah, all right. All right, Steph, thank Thanks. you so Stephanie. much.